that skunk sensors have particles and sounds of its own. But if you waterlog one, you can see it's not making any sound. And that's useful because we don't want him to know where it is until he's right up on it. So we are going to be waterlogging a skulk sensor, topping it off with a shrieker, covering it up, and having a great time. What'll also be really fun is note blocks, especially a high-pitched note block, because humans have a very hard time pinpointing where a short, high-pitched sound comes from. 